This is John T for the Boxing Voice, and I'm chatting to Ryan Robinson down the Peacock. How are you, Ryan? I'm good, my brother. How are you doing? Yeah, I'm really good, thanks, mate. How was training today? Uh, it's always hard work in the gym, man. We don't spoil ourselves around here. So, yeah, it's Friday. It's been a good week. Excellent. Well, you're up to 6-0 and now. Um, we have had you on the site recently, so it looks like you might be out in the coming months. Is that right? Uh, hopefully, my name's been put forward. You know, uh, we're trying to get some fights in. It's not easy for nobody right now, but... Um, you know what I mean? As soon as we can wrap up the gloves and, and get in there, you know what I mean? We want to get the ball rolling again. Excellent. How's life down in the Peacock Gym at the moment, in the new gym? So just showing people in the background for those that haven't seen it. Um, it seems to be buzzing down here and the environment's really good. Yeah, you know, you know it's, it's always a hard working environment here, man. It's all we do, man. We, we, we all got the same mission. We work hard, we push each other. And like I said, we don't spoil each other. The gym might look pretty, but it's nothing but, it's nothing but dog work in the gym. You know what I mean? So, yeah. Love it, love it. Look, I watched a bit of your sparring today, Ryan. It looks like you had some tough sparring in there. They, they, they tried to come and put it on you. I wouldn't say, I wouldn't say tough sparring, but yeah, you know, people come down to the gym and, and they wanna, they wanna, uh, they come down here for good sparring. You know what I mean? They come down here to test their tools, and yeah, you know what I mean. And yeah, yeah. Fair play. It's what it is. Ah, oh, look. <laughs> Ruining the interview. I'm glad you got there. Yeah, no, look, I wondered why he was laughing. Look, there's always someone who does it, no worries. Okay, yes, yes. well, look, just quickly, I wanted to ask you, I've asked a couple of the others, obviously, some sad news last week where we heard that Daniel was leaving the gym. Um, what were your thoughts on that? Uh, you know, as boxing is, he's going to do whatever he feels is best for him. You know, I don't, it just is what it is, man. And I get it, you know, you, you take it off and you want to reevaluate your situation and all of that stuff. And I just wish him the best, same as I would if he was here. You know what I mean? He's just another fighter and he's trying to do the best for him. You know what I mean? And if that's what he wanted to do, then, you know what I mean? you got to just wish him man the best and let him, let him go about his business. You know, but that doesn't change nothing here for us. You know what I mean? We're, we're still here doing our thing. Same way he's going to be where, wherever he is. With his, you know, it's life. Absolutely. Yes, bro. Just one last thing. Um, Denzel Bentley, a uh, good stable mate of yours. Look, this week it's been announced that the... Uh, Frank Warren won the purse bids for him to fight Felix Cash. What are your thoughts on that fight? Yeah, man, I'm gassed for that fight. I'm pumped for that fight. You know what I mean? Get another belt. You expect Denzel to come through that, yeah? yeah of course, man. Yeah. Of course, I expect it to be worse than the headphone fight. You know, I think that, uh, anyway, I'm not going to talk too much. Nah. I think it'll be a good fight, you know what I mean? Yeah, it will be in a fan. It'll be a good fight, man, and I think he'll rise to the occasion. He always does. And, uh, you know, people doubt him. He proves them wrong. I think it'll be a good fight. Yeah. Tough fight, yeah, but... Yeah, man. And I the fan, I fans win on the night, I think, anyway, didn't mm -hmm. they? Yeah. The fans will win on the night. The fans will, yeah, the fans will win on the night, 100%, because it's going to be a great fight. You know, it's going to be, a, it's going to be two Warriors in there, and they're going to go at it. They're putting their own in the line. Let's do it. You know what I mean? It's love. Yeah. Tough stuff. Yeah. Well, look, great catching up with you as always, and we'll be back down there when you've got your next fight announced, and we'll get, come and see you uh, leading up to that. All right, Brian? Man, I appreciate it, man. Thank you very much for having me. Just Cheers, mate. Shout out the gym, man. Shout out Chris Borky, too. Yeah, I've just interviewed Chris he's over there somewhere. He's been, Great oh, win. He's been knocking people out lately, so he told me he'd put me on the list if I don't shout him out. So shout out Chris, <laughs> shout out Tom. Bit, Larry, bit of a weight Uncle difference, Larry. but he'd have a go at you. No, no, there ain't no weight difference. So he's heavy handed, man. He punches like a tank. Good stuff. The beast. Check his highlight room. Good shout out for Chris. <laughs> Thanks a lot, Ryan. Cheers. So if you enjoyed the video, feel free to hit the like, subscribe, and share. As always, if you want to support us to the next level, head over to the Patreon com backslash the boxing voice we have tons of exclusive from border wars and title betting shows the list goes on and on and on but in addition to that if you guys have questions for fighters trainers or promoters this is where you can submit them we will run out get these questions answered and put it back on the show just for you guys appreciate it peace